Welcome to Chartmill. In this short video, I will show you how to quickly and easily create and manage your personal watch lists in Chartmill. Now, watch lists play a key role in the Chartmill stock screening tool. They allow you to group specific interesting shares and to retrieve them quickly at any time. Clear, time saving, and much more convenient than the handwritten post its next to your computer. But before you can create such a list, you first need a basic selection. And out of this first selection, you then choose your own favorite ones, which you then put into a watch list. This basic selection can be obtained by screening yourself or by using a predefined screen filter. And we've already made a separate video about the screen filter functionality, of which I will put a link below in the description. In this video, I use the bull flag filter from the trading ideas page. And I have further refined the results by only selecting the American market. Furthermore, two more volume filters have been added. Initially, I limited the selection to only those stocks which have a minimum average trading volume of 500k. And the second volume filter ensures that only stocks whose volume on the last trading day were higher than the previous trading day are selected. I then make a personal selection and shares that I think are worth following up on are added to a watch list, clicking on the plus sign and adding them to a new or existing watch list. In case you want to create a new watch list, you have to enter a unique name in the text field and then press enter. If you want to request those shares again at a later time, you can do so very quickly and easily. On the home page, you go to the stock charts page and click on the map icon. You select the watch list you want to view in the menu and you can immediately proceed with your personal selection. You can also view your watch list via your personal profile page, but we will come back to that later. Other possible watch lists, open positions, for example, to have a quick overview of all your open stock positions, a watch list of closed positions, for example, to keep an eye on the price of a closed position, or a list of some important index ETFs. For example, I have a watch list in use with the four most important US index ETFs. And with one click, I have a very nice overview of the completely US market. To edit existing watch lists, you go to your personal settings page by clicking on your username in the upper right corner. This will take you to your personal account page. And in the horizontal menu, you select watch lists, after which you will see all your existing watch lists. And here you can edit, rename or delete them. By clicking on the arrow next to a watch list, you can see which shares are in a specific list. And here you can easily remove individual shares from the list. For example, because they no longer meet your criteria while you added them in the first place, or because you may have already purchased them and they are now part of a different watch list. You can open, rename or delete the watch lists by pressing the corresponding button. This concludes this video. If you have any questions or tips about using watch lists, be sure to leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.